What is going on, Get Lean Journey peeps? I'm leaving the house, got to run an errand. Hadn't made a live in a few days, so I figured I would get up here and say howdy from Texas. Oh man, it's been, uh, been a good day. Um, went to the gym this morning, got a uh, leg workout in with my brother David. He beasted it as always, and I just did the best I could. But hey, little progress is better than no progress. So, can't complain, can't complain. But I'm here to Walmart. And yes, I got my Don't Be a Snowflake shirt on. Gonna go in here and uh, might ruffle some feathers. This day and time, you, you can't even wear nothing out the house without somebody getting offended. They might even get offended by my hat. But let me tell you. You don't like that hat? Should have took your little stimulus check and left the country. But anyway, I've been watching the news, keeping up with some stuff. Try not to, as try not to, but I do still keep up with some of it. And, you know, we all got our entitled to our opinions, and I'm entitled to mine. And I think what's going on right now is absolutely ridiculous, stupid. You know changing the names of this and changing the names of that what is this world coming to but i do believe jesus will be back soon because if something don't change uh it, it's just a sign it's just a sign but it's uh it's it's absolutely it's sad it's sad what's going on right now and you know i'm a hundred percent hundred percent behind people voicing their opinion or or, or their freedom of speech. I got nothing against that. More power to you. Hey, that's your right. Do it. You know. But if you want to burn flags and um and disrespect our country, then get out. Leave. Bye bye. Uh, you want to stand in the road where it's made for vehicles and block traffic? Get run over. I'm not stopping. I'm just going to file an insurance claim that hit a deer or something you know I'm, I'm not stopping i mean it's it's people are crazy it's freaking crazy i don't understand it you know and uh people are gonna get sick of this and they're gonna stop bowing down to everybody and and they're gonna take it in their own hands and then it's gonna get real ugly um because i can promise you most good old americans ain't leaving the house without something in their vehicle if you follow me and if you try to enter my vehicle or mess with me or my family, I will give you lead poisoning. That's guaranteed. Um, but yeah, getting ready to uh, do some concealed carry stuff here in Texas, matter of fact, um, here in the next couple weeks. And uh, just because everything that's going on here is just crazy, absolutely crazy. But um that's my opinion on that, and I'm gonna go up in Walmart with this. You know, how more American can you be? I got my American flag on my arm, so hey, gonna go up in here. Might make somebody mad, but you know, I don't care. If everybody else can voice their opinion, I can voice mine too. If you don't like it, later, tater. But it's just, it's just so sad. It's just what's really sad to me is our next generation which some of them are the problem right now some of them not all of them um you know uh it's gonna have to grow up in this world um that that, that is getting worse by the day can you imagine what it's gonna be like 20 years from now i mean absolutely crazy you know <sighs> and you know it, it starts at home really uh, people don't a lot of people don't want to um own up to it but it starts at home you know once your kids get grown and they go off on their own paths then you know that's fine and dandy but some kids it's just drilled in their mind they need to be a certain way you know and i and i judge people by the way they treat me and you know for their character that's how i judge people um if more people would judge other people by their character and, and learn to um, love each other instead of hate each other, you know, this world will be a better place. Because <sighs> there's a lot of hate going on and not a lot of love. Um, I try to make it 
make it a point to go out of my way and try to be nice to somebody every day. Um, you know, just it's just a shame. It's just a shame. But I'm pulling up into Walmart. I got to run in here and pick up something. Um, get ready to do my refeed for tonight. I'm ready to eat some pie and play some cards and have some good old time. Have a good old time tonight. Might even hand me a, 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 a Tito's or two, you know. But uh, Walmart is packed as usual. Um, anyway, if you gather anything from this video, look, stand up. For what you believe in, you know, I don't, like I said, it's freedom of speech. If you, if you want to voice your opinion, please do. But you ain't got to go out and like, act like a complete idiot, a barbarian, or just a freaking numbskull. You know, you ain't got to be like that to get your opinion across. You can do it. You can do it by being nice, you know. Well, which I will admit, not, you know, nice people, usually people try to take advantage of them, but, you know. But anyway, let me see who's up here. Hey, Aubrey, Jacob, Lisa, Jimmy, Eric, Keith, Jennifer, Natasha, Joseph, Brandon, Kevin. Thanks, Jennifer. It's my favorite hat. Jody, Ricky, and Tyler. But anyway, if you want to, if you want to share this video, I'm getting ready to go up here, spread the love. And by this shirt, some people take it out of context. Don't be a snowflake means to me, don't let the little things make you fall apart or melt, you know. Um, don't, don't, don't do that, you know. That's what I mean, you know. Somebody sees me walk by with my American flag hat on and just, oh, blah, 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 whatever, you know. I've been lucky enough that's not happened to me. Then you're being a snowflake. I mean, really. You don't like this country deuces see you later alligator but uh let's spread some love and stop spreading the hate it's enough of that going around but anyway we're gonna go up in here with the people of walmart and pick up a couple things and um head on back to the house hope everyone has a awesome blessed weekend Thank you for tuning in once again. If you need anything, give me a holler and get a little willing. We'll see y'all later.